Yo, what's up everybody? It's Superfly Fat Guy 859 coming at you again. Alright guys, so uh, I want to start a little tag. Um, see if I can get mine to be as uh, successful as I've seen a lot of them get. Um, I'm going to tag, you know, a bunch of people that... Uh, that I think would be awesome for this, but then I'm going to tag some bigger names and uh, and actually see if if they respond. Um, I don't think I, I only think a couple of these guys are actually sub to me, or maybe three out of four is. I know one of them isn't, uh, but I got four guys that uh, I want to see if they'll actually respond. But the basically the name of the game or the tag that I'm going to submit is um, your absolute favorite carry blade and that's basically whatever you're allowed to carry uh that you literally you know you try out other blades but it seems like you always go back to this one blade and i want to know what blade that is um me personally <laughs> mine is the manix 2 translucent blue i mean this thing to me is the epitome of gorgeous um it's this this beautiful I guess that's like their their leaf shaped blade um, the, the blade shape is absolutely gorgeous to me I think it's extremely sexy um, I love the full flat grind I don't know what kind of bevel that is but I'm guessing it's like a like a V grind um, it's extremely sharp I don't even have compound for the Dave Matic one yet and just run you know just a daily use on this look you can see my bald ass head <laughs> just a, a daily use of this you know at the end of the day or when I'm sitting here watching videos or whatever I'll just strop it a few times um, I don't know I still don't know anything about stro uh, stropping guys but there's this like lighter side and then there's like this darker side and I don't know if that's a difference but I'll start on this side and end on this side so I don't know if if one makes the difference than the other but um, at any rate uh, I absolutely love this blade the only thing um, I love it so much that I never want to let it go and the problem with that is uh, I, I get kinda scared of losing it or dropping it you know or having it stolen or for whatever reason having it confiscated <laughs> you know i mean literally just uh, just not having it anymore um i thought i was going to get uh another one of these uh but it turns out it looks like um it was stolen i mean i'm not sh for sure on that but it looks like it was stolen on its way f uh from uh england i think i think that's where uh mr knives rs is from um at any rate you know I you know I don't have the other one so um, I was hoping I could uh, get another one so that I could carry this like literally every day and not worry about losing it or what have you uh, but it's absolutely it's absolutely gorgeous guys and I love it um, <laughs> Golden Colorado USA Earth these these finger grooves are amazing this right here is easily the most comfortable knife that I own and and maybe the most comfortable knife I've ever put in my hand this pocket clip is the only pocket clip I've ever felt in my entire life that literally just fades away in the palm of your hand you you never feel that it just kind of melts in your hand you never I mean okay of course you feel it but it never there's not a hot spot at all um, whatsoever and I mean you can grip this thing look I you can see the white on my fingers I'm squeezing the shit out of this knife and nothing nothing at all now you're gonna get those you know you're gonna get that that uh, uh, texture you know and print it on your fingers but uh I mean just from I mean I could use this blade all day long you could also choke up get a really nice uh, choke up on this for really I mean you could really do some fine cutting tasks uh, it's just an overall absolutely gorgeous knife um, extremely oversized uh, spidey hole you guys have seen me uh, flip that and uh, with my pinky so my pinky fits comfortably in there that's a, and I got some fat fingers guys so that's a very generous spidey hole 
Um, it's just an overall absolutely gorgeous knife, guys. And then it comes with the tool steel, so the CTS BD1. Uh, absolutely phenomenal overall. So this is my absolute fair, uh, favorite uh, carry option, carry blade for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, and and put the camera on me and come right back to you, and I'll tell you who I'm tagging. All right, folks. So we're back, and uh, I everybody that I tagged because I <laughs> I got quite a few people. I'd appreciate it if you uh, if you posted your 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 tag uh, as a video response to this video. Uh, that way I can just watch them all because I I'm, I really do want to see these. So, but I also I'm tagging so many people because I do want to get this out there, and uh, I just think it'd be really cool to be like, hey, you know, I started that. I think that'd be really sweet. So, um, first off, Taddy Boy Two. Now, we've seen several of your knives, dude, but uh, I'd really like to see the one that you absolute love to carry. It's your favorite carry option. You always go back to that one. Bucks Fan 10, I, I feel like I know what one yours is, but I'd like to see yours too. Uh, Cynric 77, dude, you got so many, but I I think I know yours too. I believe it's a, a razor of some kind. But uh, <laughs> let's see, you know, let's see what you got. Uh, CBBA 50. Let's see what you got, brother. Uh, Mr. Coop 1967. What do you carry, man? Kick ass knife maker. What do you carry? <laughs> Ford Stang Lover. Brother, let's see what you carry on a, on a daily basis. Your absolute favorite carry knife. Roman, Roman Legionnaire 77. Brother, you have got the most gorgeous custom knife collection. But I want to see what knife do you carry on a daily basis that you absolutely love like you it's it's it never fails you love that one you always go back to that one voices of defense george brother i know you talk about guns all the time but let's see what you got man what do you carry do you carry a blade every day if so i want to see it dude i want to see your absolute favorite carry blade bps7 us1 bro i want to see yours too for sure all right so here we got uh, the the four bigger uh, channels that I'd really like to see. I'd like to see what you guys carry. What's your favorite carry knife? The Low Buck Prepper. I don't know. Uh, I know you're sub to me, but I don't know if you uh, if you watch all my videos. So hopefully you watch this one and you do a response because I want to see it. East Coast Prepper or uh, was it Guns and Gadgets? I think. Either one you want to do it on, brother. I want to see the like you're at because I know you, I know you. You probably got more knives than anybody on YouTube combined. <laughs> so East Coast Prepper, I want to see what your favorite carry blade is, brother. Uh, exacto. Come on, bro. I think I already know what it's going to be, but I want to tag you anyway because I think you can get the ball rolling on this uh, this this tag. But I think I could be wrong, but I think it's going to be the Ti Millie. But I could be wrong. But it seems like it's always on you. <laughs> and then last but not least, I don't know if he'll ever even see this, but Cutlery Lover, I want to see what your absolute... Because I know you got a lot of blades. I know you go through a lot of blades. You know, you sell them, trade them, what have you. But at the end of the day, when it's all said and done, what is your absolute favorite carry blade that you go to every day? Um, or at least you go back to at some point all the time. So anyway, guys, that's all my tags. Uh, I am going to put everybody's link below. Go ahead and check them out. I'm sorry for the long video. I try to keep my videos uh, short uh, here lately, but this one fairly long. So anyway, guys, take it easy. Do the tag. Post it as a VR to this video. Peace.